All right, so we're here to do the C challenge. And actually, I didn't even want to... Hold on, hold on. I need to make sure I have my Baduk board coordinates on. Um, this, is, this is a really weird challenge because basically it states in order to win the... I have to win the game and not play any stones along the C line the entire game. So I can play on the D and the B, but not the C line. And so that's pretty weird, right? <laughs> It might seem easy at first. We're just going to play something kind of ridiculous like that. Uh, it might it might seem like it's really easy just to avoid playing on a whole line, but at some point at the end of the game, like, the board fills in. And so it's not like you can avoid playing it forever. And so my strategy... I really should have played a 4-4 stone in the bottom left to open. I really regret playing in the top right. Because uh, it's really hard for me to do anything with this 4-4 corner except just give him the whole thing. Uh, yeah. Let's keep some pressure on. <laughs> it's also actually already, I'm already, like, annoyed, right? Because what I really have to do is convince him to take all, like, third-line territory on the left-hand side of the board and get a wall here and then attack what's ever in the middle. But if he is, like, building small little bases over here, that's really annoying. Uh, good. Okay. All right. I... <laughs> So tragic. Hmm. All right, this is interesting. So, so we're clearly losing this game at the moment. Uh, I think we block here, or we blockade him in this way. So I'm pretty solid over here. Uh, I'm just not allowed to ever play a stone on the this line. I have to remember that. Really trying hard not to screw that up. We have, to, we have to have really big dreams here on the right, right, to sort of balance all the territory. We just sort of have to seed to the left. That's not, not forcing. Seems kind of bad, in fact. Is he just running out now? All right. Well, if we just kill this whole group, that's a way to win the game without having to play on the sea line. That's a way to do it. It's pretty good. Also, just be warned, I have the four-year-old upstairs watching Moana right now. So, I'm playing a little bit of... I don't know, playing with fire, I guess? <laughs> do I need to do it this way? It doesn't... Uh, I'll just leave that Aji there. Um, yeah, I think I can just play this way. Keep up the pressure. Mm-hmm. This moves the greedier or shape one, but we're going to play it. Again, we got to have big dreams over here. It's the biggest dreams of all. Oh, my God, he doesn't want me to have the big dreams. But I must. I must have the biggest of dreams. I should probably just turn here. This tanuki felt real... Like, it should be punished. <laughs> all right, let's just keep going. This makes the 3-3 three, three point actually a good invasion for him. Uh, okay. Co? There's a co shape here. All right, let's turn here and then come back. We've already kind of upset his shape enough. <sighs> See, I really want to be able to attach here. Oh, maybe, maybe actually I can. Because this is going to induce him to play along the third line. Is that genius? I think it's genius. Right, because he's going to stand. I'm going to block. He's going to push through, and instead of blocking here, I'm just going to push out. That's not really that genius. Never mind. Because <laughs> I can just do that anyway. All right, I think we should do it anyway. Like this is this is this is the type of move that gets me in trouble. Oh no, that's not what I wanted. Hmm. Can we play this one now? Or we just play this one. Let's play this one. I was really trying to do some so hard to playing the third line for me and crawling. Uh, I am only playing against three on account. So 
y'all can complain about that, I guess. But this is hard. <laughs> These are real challenges. Uh, okay, looks like he's just gonna live. That's fine. Uh, he's probably gonna honey there to live, which is actually really annoying. But we'll do it. Oh, he's gonna find cuts first? That doesn't seem like a good idea. Best way to fix? Eh. Let's be really solid. We're just gonna pretend that we're killing all this. Oh man, I hear Moana screaming in the background. Not screaming, beautiful singing is what I meant to say. Uh, he's gonna poke at this shape and then we're gonna have three fights. That seems reasonable. This is the way with all them. I have to be real, like, like so, so I have to remember, my opponent doesn't know that I can't play the third line. <laughs> but if I play moves like this and he pushes and cuts, like, it's actually, well, in this case it's fine. But later on, these cuts are really hard to defend if I can't play a third line stone. So I'd really like to, like, my, my caution about this line of death, this line of instant re resignation, oh... That's really hard to answer without playing a third line move. Okay. All right. It's gonna let him off the hook, it looks like. Oh my god. Uh, okay. This is good, this is good. This is the shape point though. Yep. All right, this is fine. I have this, this cut is, oh dear. <laughs> I can't actually defend this technically. So if he reads, well, I can't, I would say, if, if I can play a third line, I can defend it. So this is all about whether or not he can actually read enough moves to realize that I can defend this. Oh man. Oh man. <sighs> this is hard. <sighs> like this is this is the point, this is the obvious point to to just live over here and I can't play it. So Can I play one more? Let's just keep pushing here. I don't think it's right, but I'm re like I'm really hamstrung. Like I can't live over here. How do I do this? Like I can I can I can assess, I have two choices, right? I can I can connect very pig-headed here, which in case he's gonna hane, and then I have no follow-up, or. I tried to do something really fancy and confuse him about this cut. I think we go for confusion. Uh, I am black, dude. Daddy? And, and, and we are the pigs. You are the pigs? Hey, I thought you were watching Moana. I need some help taking off his head. <laughs> you need some help taking yeah, off his yeah, head. Yeah, Mommy showed me a trick. A trick, you say? Y yeah. T twist. And pull. Oh, did it not work? No. Nope. Uh, we're taking a Lego man head off. Okay, there you go. And you did twist and pull. I did twist and pull. That was the trick. Yeah. What do you say? Thank you. Okay, that went well. That went well. Uh, okay. Okay. I'm in, I'm in a little bit of trouble here. <laughs> Oh, let's drink some smoothie. <laughs> That'll always help. Hmm. Okay, we help out the weaker group here. 
but we still really need to kill something because I can't live with this without playing third line stones. Let's try this very strange shape. Okay. Hmm. This is weird. <laughs> this is so weird. Uh, I guess. Oh, dear. I can't play the third line. I can pretend I can play the third line, though, right? There's nothing saying I can pretend to have stones on the third line. But, like, I need to kill something. Oh, dear, he's gonna figure me out. Uh, this is this is getting to be difficult. All right, push here once and then try to split, help this stone. Okay. Uh, all right, we definitely did some things wrong. I needed I needed to start on the four four in the bottom left hand corner because I because any sort of you guys just saw what happened right with this fight like any sort of fight like I can't just make a live shape. It's kind of embarrassing. Okay. Oh man, this cut. It's called a hope and a prayer. This is the hope and the prayer cut. Hmm. That's good. That is a nice response to my hope and a prayer cut. Or is it? Actually, that... Might not be good enough. More smoothie. <laughs> Need energy for this. That is a meaty smoothie. I really need some tea. Oh no. <laughs> Don't push in there. He's going to push in there next, and I can't connect. <laughs> Strangely, this would have worked better against a higher level opponent than a <laughs> three on, I think. Oh, man. All right, let's, let's just keep working on this. Oh, my God. He's got all the bamboo joints, too. All right, going to net him. All right, so if, if he's able to read, that's a big if. I have six liberties with my group. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Looks like he's got seven. He can get up to nine. So this is going to short himself a liberty, but he's going to continue the fight. That's okay. We're okay with this. Actually, he doesn't have that many, right? Because, yeah, this is only this only counts as one. Like, a, a bamboo joint, in this case, only counts as one. I miscounted. Uh, I need this move to prevent him from getting more. Hmm... Oh. It's real tempting not to connect there. But he can make an eye here, right? Push in, push in. But it's only one. Overtime countdown has begun. Oh dear. That looks like a good move. <laughs> Is it a good move? I don't know. Oh, we're gonna go to Ko. 
Oh, I, oh, it's ugly too. That's really ugly. <laughs> hmm. Actually, what's funny is I play here, it actually dissuades him from pushing it again because then it's Gote for him. That's an interesting quirk to this whole situation. Oh, this isn't even Ko. Yeah, this isn't even Ko. This is, this is, sorry, I totally misread this. Um, oh, no, it, it, no, I'm still okay. I'm still okay because he needs that too, right? He needs to have one extra liberty here. All right, I think it is Ko. Let's come back around to thinking this is Ko. Hmm. I now have to think of all the things that are kind of like Ko threats. Uh, does this? Does he know something? I is this Ko? Just Ko, yeah? Mm hmm, 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 hmm. Oh, not Ko, right? He can still Atari this down. Hmm. That's not good. <laughs> oh, okay. He's going to fight on the outside? Oh, no, it's co-threat. Right, 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 right. <laughs> We're fighting a co. I have to remember this. <laughs> this is important. Uh, so... I could have, like, infinite co-threats here with this ladder. <laughs> Should I do it? Nine, eight, Not really infinite. Seven, six... Five. I think we have to do it. Like, he's going to kill everything in the middle, but... Oh, that's going to link up this group, too. Yeah, that's going to be a huge loss. Um, but if my ladder stone survives... Okay, all right. So, we're good. We saved the left. Kind of. But he he linked up his weak groups. Yep, and he killed the whole center. All right. This is pretty big move. All right, so he's got a pretty big center. Uh, this seems fine, right? Maybe play this way first. Kind of make a base for the weaker part of the... Oh, he's not going to let me do that. Okay. This is the normal move. Um, but I really want to take the opportunity to cut this stone off. Seems pretty reasonable. Ah, let's play normal move. Um, <clears throat> like, I can't connect here. All right, so this is really 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34. Yeah, he's, he's over 70 points at this point. This is a little difficult to find 70 points. I just, I just have to play such like a crazy person because I can't make a base over here. Very traumatizing. Okay. Uh, a little tragic. <laughs> That's not going to get me 70 points. Uh, yeah. I wonder... I just live small here. Feels like I'm strong enough to do Nine, so. Eight. Let's try it. 
Oh, actually, yeah, if he honeys on top, I just honey back. And let him live small, and I'll take whatever points are here. Oh, he's not even going to let me have that. He is a madman. Actually, it's all pretty reasonable. <laughs> oh, this is interesting. <laughs> Let's ask if he wants to do the complicated way. <laughs> Or the simple. I think the simple way is better for him. Oh, this is even more simple than I thought, actually. Hmm. This is even simpler. I thought he would Atari here and then take the stone would be the complicated way. Atari here and connect would be the simple way. I really want to play this move. Oh, man. I kind of can. I think I'm strong enough. Let's go, team. Let's find 70 points. Uh, <laughs> I, don't, I don't know about this sequence. <laughs> but White has to work really hard to live here. Super duper hard. Hmm? Oh my gosh, this works. For white, that is. Um, that's, that's a good net. Okay. <laughs> I read the other net. <laughs> sad. So sad. <laughs> Can't even play in the third line over here. <laughs> Eight, I can't seven, even destroy this. Six, five, four. Uh, I don't know. I can reduce the points here. I don't know what to do. Uh, this might be resignable. Like. Hmm. Oh, what if I play here? Yeah, we just play here. And hope. Hope. Oh, I still can't invade here. Right. I can't do anything. I, 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 I can't kill this. <laughs> Under normal circumstances, I would be able to kill that. That, this is dead. Nine, eight, seven, <laughs> How do I make it feel like I killed it? Five, four. This, this, yep. Okay. I didn't play on the third line. I'm still good. The C challenge is still alive. I have to convince him that it's dead, though, without playing on the third line. This is, this is now a game of, psycho, of psychology. Yeah, this cut was too much. I'm sad about this. Uh. Hmm. This is it's still dead. But I can't kill it. He tanukis. That's encouraging. That is hope. That's what hope looks like. <laughs> Connecting the stone is also huge. Like this is this is such a huge endgame move, and I can't play it. This is this is. I I actually thought I would do better at this challenge. I'm like I could I play hit and move go like I know how to use stones on the board that are or are not there, or play fearful. <laughs> like I know how to do all the things. This is this would be nice if I could play this one, but so I'm gonna I'm gonna owe a move here. He's just gonna hunt it here. Uh, I can't I can't win. 
because this has to get played as endgame. Uh, might work if I have fewer liberties. Yeah, like, like he's always going to push in here as an endgame move, at which point I can never play here, and then he just connects and makes it live. Like, the jig is up. Um, so even if this is dead, and even Nine, if that's enough points, eight, seven, it's totally six, not. Five, four. Let's just connect there. Um, like, and those are two big ifs, given how the rest of this is gone. I don't know what to play here. I'll just play that one. It's silly, but I I think this this is a C challenge fail, guys. Mm, okay. He's just looking for things, right? There's not actual things, there's just the appearance of things. Oh, it's actually close to being something. <laughs> uh, all right, let's do a count. Man, this is still... <laughs> So huge. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. Um, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 33, 1, 32, 33. Uh, yeah, so we're still hanging around 70 points. Nine, it's not... 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Totally not a terrible score. But... Uh, I think I have time to save this, right? Uh, he gets all this outside stuff. 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17. So this right here is about 35 points in a normal game. <laughs> um, another 10 here, 45, you know, just over 50. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Close to 20, a little under 20, 15. 65, 67. Nine, eight, seven, like it's a close six. game. Five, four, three. Overtime countdown has begun. But I, it's he's always going to push in here. So unless unless I can kill something else or make him resign some other way, the C line challenge will not be completed today. Do I need? I should probably take this right now. Right. <laughs> I mean, I can pretend I can kill it. <laughs> right? Uh, this is a liberty, right? I think. <laughs> I hope. Hmm. He's got a lot of threats too. <laughs> well, nope. <laughs> Nope, 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 nope.
All right, down goes the sea line challenge. Um, what am I going to say about this? Yeah, I think I think this the the problem started right here. I need to play on the fourth line. I just need to just build a wall on the fourth line quickly and convince my opponent that he can invade and just continue to build the wall, just pressure him down on the third line. Yeah, taking a move that's not next to the line I need to defend, like really, really puts me at a disadvantage. Like, because once once he has this corner, like I can't really do anything fighting over here, right? Like, even this stuff feels good for white. I, I, you know, I just, I just felt like my claws were cut the whole game. I wanted to think more about this. If you guys have some ideas for me for how to beat the sea line challenge, uh, you know, feel free to leave them in the comments. Uh, I do think, I do think the current key is starting along the fourth line here and inducing my opponent to take all the third and second line points that he can. Um, because, yeah, once I got to, let's see, this section where I sort of forced this weak group to run this way, and then invited this cut. Actually, this cut was okay. No, I, well, yeah, this, this cut is normally unreasonable, right, for white? Like, white's just basically making a weak group for fun. Like, it's not really cutting anything. At any point, I could just come back and connect. Um, and I'm like, well, we gotta, we gotta, you know game on, right? We got to fight, show fighting spirit, but then he just cuts here and I can't really prevent it. Like there's no way for me to link up now. I really get even anything out of it. Um, so I'm stuck in this fight. Like he, he can just, he can just cut through here and force this group to try to live locally. And it's so hard to do. Um, so I can't let that happen. That's, that's, that's really the, the big takeaway. I thought I was pretty safe enough, um, you know, because I'm already up at the 5th, 6th line. Uh, all right, I'm a little bit sad. We'll have to try this again. Again, leave your comments if you have ideas, best strategies, how to beat the C-line challenge, and try it out in your own games, you know? Maybe maybe sandbag a little bit, you know, find an opponent, you know, two or three stones weaker than you are, and see if you can pick, any, you know, in this case, a third line on any edge of the go board you want, and just never play any stones there. Um, oh, also, maybe this would be easier. Actually, this would be an easier challenge if, if I got to pick the line during the game, right? Rather than prescribe it as this line. But if I play it out, you know, an opening, and then at some point in the game decided, oh, yeah, I don't have any stones on this line, so this is going to be the third line I'm not going to play on. I don't really want to do that. I think that's kind of against the spear of the challenge, but that might be a way to make it a little bit more attainable. Anyway, hope you're enjoying these challenge games. I also hope that you're playing a lot more Go, and that's part of your New Year's resolution. So, happy going.